Now, have you ever noticed just how fast your little baby grows up? So much so that before you know it, they're bringing home their first boyfriend or girlfriend. This one's never having a boyfriend. Well, today on the Baby Channel, we have the perfect solution to capture all the cuteness of your little baby's first weeks. Little impressions make wonderful three-dimensional plaster casts of your little one's hands and feet, providing a lasting and original memento of your child's baby days. So, not wanting to miss out, why would I? Scarlett, my seven-week-old daughter here, is going to have her hands and feet cast by Tony Franks and Fiona North, who are the founders of Little Impressions. Welcome to both of you. Thank you. Now, I'm hoping to get her in a good mood, so I feel <laughs> we should do this as soon as possible. First of we all, will. what's the end result? Show us, Tony. You've got some examples there. Well, here's a six-week-old, uh, much the same age as Scarlett, uh, and we take her an impression in the clay, and then we cast it in plaster, and then we frame it in a traditional method in an oak frame. They're absolutely so beautiful. So this is the end result. And you've been doing it now for 19 years, Fiona, haven't you, I since have. you cast your son's feet. Absolutely. And everyone's been copying you, so we've got the original <laughs> team here. <laughs> Let's hope so. Now, I want to talk to you more about what you do, but I feel that we should capture the moment while she's fairly quiet, not that I have a difficult <laughs> child, and show me what do we do. So if you, you come right. round next to me, okay. and I shall follow your instructions. So I get down on the we ground, need, do yep, I? We need to be. And we're going to do her hands. We're going to we? do her hands. Oh, I'm going right. to do her left hand followed by her right hand. Okay, so you take on one of her hands. Shall I move her closer? Yeah, brilliant. Poor baby with a dummy. And good girl. And you're going to press right. her hands down. Whee! There you go, little one. You're pressing each <laughs> finger down. Oh, she's not sure whether she likes no, this. Absolutely. Oh, there you go. Ah, yeah. oh, take her hand out. Yeah, she you might not want to give her the back. No, it's not something I like to use. There we go. Oh, come on. You're going to look at these for years to come. Yes, you are. Good little girl. Good girl, good girl. Do I hold that hand? Yep, do. Oh, it's not fun, is it? Although it must feel quite nice for them, does well, it? Well, it does. It's terribly soft. soft, the clay. Good girl. Oh, I think she's hungry. That's the problem. It's not that you're hurting her. It's actually, it's very soft, it's doesn't very, it? It's very soft. There we go. Oh, there we go. Fantastic. Well done. Oh, sweetheart. We did catch you at a bad moment. Yeah. Right. That's great. If you sit down. I think I'm going to hand it to somebody. I'm no fool. Let's hand it to Barbara. There you go. There we are. Right, so. Okay. <laughs> Usually, I suppose they cry sometimes, but <laughs> they don't cry sometimes. They do. And tell me, how long does this take then to come back as the finished article that's sitting next to you? Well, here? it can take probably a couple of weeks. It takes about a week to dry. Um, so about a couple of weeks before you, you get the finished article. And they are really popular, aren't they? I mean, you've been doing lots of different kinds yes. of babies. Yes. Well, I've been doing them constantly for 18 years, so I've seen many babies. And lots of celebrity babies. Everyone wants to know about babies, the celebrity absolutely. babies. So which celebrity babies have you done? Can you tell us? Well, I don't know if I can, <laughs> can I? <laughs> but you've certainly been um, a business that has gone from you know tiny beginnings, literally, yes. And now Tony's come as your business partner. What difference have you made to this company? Well, when I discovered Fiona, Fiona had sort of been doing it from home, um, uh, sort of part-time around the children for several years. And I discovered her eight years ago, in fact, eight years this month, in, in October it, it was, and uh, with my eldest daughter. And I just saw them on a colleague's wall and fell in love with them and, and had to have them done. And I remember saying to my wife at that time, this would be a fabulous thing for you to do. You wouldn't have to go back to work. In, in those days we had showrooms in the West End of London and we were in the fashion business. And then busy lives, we just forgot about it until my second daughter came along. Uh, Evie's now five and a half. So we traipsed all the way back to Clapham, as, as, as you have to do. And it was at that point I asked Fiona if she'd train my wife up. And, and having, you put the idea in of a franchise yeah, into your head. You had been asked several times before and yes. we teamed up and decided to try it as a franchise. So now you can get this done all over the country? Yeah, we've, uh, we have 31 out there now um, from Scotland through Wales and down into Cornwall. Uh, we've got about another six on the way. Um, so we, we're growing organically rather than trying to force it. And it's generally young mums working from home much like Fiona did working around the, their children. And how much does it cost? That's what everyone wants to know because this is beautifully done. It's kind of the creme de la creme of impressions. Are they expensive? I don't think so. No, no you wouldn't <laughs> say that. Tell us how much. I mean, how much would this particular hands and feet set This cost? one is 120. And um, if you just had the hands done or just had the feet done? The hands are 95. And a single hand or foot, it's much like this one. 
that we showed earlier is 65. So that's the starting block. Yes, and very beautiful, actually, just on its own, isn't it? it you Absolutely. don't need to have the whole body. No. I was going to ask you, are you ever asked to cast more than the hands and feet? Do people want unusual casts made? Yes, sometimes very cheeky. Normally males come up to us at <laughs> exhibitions and ask <laughs> if we, we cast other things. Um, um, that's part of the training in the franchise is how to deal with with comments like that and, and, and send them away scurrying embarrassingly away. So. Oh really, so there's nothing that uh, the women cast that they can't deal with, no comments. And do you think that um, something like this will be a phase that people will stop doing or do you think it's something people will always want to do? I think, I, I thought the same thing. Um, I thought they were just a, a, a flash in the pan fashionable thing but, you know, 19 years later, and they are hanging on hundreds and hundreds of walls, and people still do want them. And they're quite contemporary looking now. They're, they're pretty timeless as, a, as something to look at. Is there an ideal age that people should bring their babies to you? I have a friend who has a whole range of feet of all her children, and they're all done at four months. Is that an optimum age? To I think four months is a good age. I think that Scarlett was probably a little bit too she small. Was she, lesser, was, she was, She was very little. Um, they do tend to have the little curled up hands. So it's hard to get them to flatten they're little like them. that. I usually say from, from 12 weeks. Because they're more cooperative. Yeah, and, they, and they've discovered think. their hands by then. Um, and are happier to have them flattened out. And the finished product, we're looking, you always put them in an oak frame, but yes. I know you can have different coloured backings and things like we that. We have a choice of nine different colour backings. We can um, either wax this or lime it. We use oak specifically. It's, it's a very hard wood and very difficult wood to work with, but we know, and this is my daughter Lilia, when she was six months old, when Lily has children, this is going to be around and she'll be able to hold her baby's hand up to her own as a baby and that I think is a timeless classic and that's what we've aimed to achieve. Now that'll make them coming to you rushing in their thousands. <laughs> also if there's a family quirk as well you might see it repeated down the line. Mind you, we, yes, is, that, fact, is that this, a family quirk? This They're is a family toes. quirk and uh, we recently did well both girls and their cousin Sebastian and Sebastian has this slightly um, parted toe. I think that's like fascinating that. so it really does make you feel part of a clan doesn't yes. it and there is the mm. evidence. Mm. Well, thank you both very much for coming in to show us how it's done. And people who want to know where they can go, who are living in, in Scarborough and who are living down in Portsmouth, they can just ring up their local There's franchise. There's two, two ways. We have a call centre uh, with a free phone number, which is 0800 019 3950. We'll have that number for them. And Or you can go on the website and you can put a postcode in and it will direct you to the nearest franchisee. So no more traipsing to your kitchen in Clapham. Indeed. They can go all over the country. <laughs> Tony and Fiona, thank you both very thank much. Thank you.